Hi guys, I'm back with my second post time video. If you haven't watched the first one, you might want to go back and watch that first, but otherwise, let's get stuck in. Okay, so not a massive um, post um, kind of haul, I don't know what you call it, not a massive set of parcels, I don't know. Okay, <laughs> not loads of posts basically. Got a couple of bits, one, two, three, four. Um, I'm going to start with one of my Amazon Prime um, packages, which was something that I ordered, I think the back end of last week, and I haven't opened it yet because I'm waiting to film this. Um, but here we go. This is tiny. Um, so the first item in the post is the little book of Heige. Is it Heige or Hugi? I can't remember. There is a way to pronounce it. Anyway, it's basically around the Danish art of living well, um, kind of slow living, um, enjoying life, enjoying the simple things. It's all about that. Um, and there's been loads of, I think, bloggers on Instagram and YouTube, or maybe not so much YouTube, but definitely Instagram, maybe kind of... Um, blogs as well. I've seen them reading this book or a version of it. So um, I was curious and wanted to know what the fuss was about. So I've got myself a copy and I'm really looking forward to reading it. I'm wondering if it's going to be good enough to beat um, the book that I'm reading at the moment, which is Big Magic, which I am absolutely loving. If you haven't read this already, definitely consider reading it. It's so good. Like It's, the fa it's like my favourite book that I've read in ages. I've read a fair few books, but it's really, really good. For anybody who's like a blogger or a creative, it's a must read, for sure. So anyway, I will have a read of this at some point and maybe share my thoughts on my blog or Instagram, maybe even YouTube. I'll kind of see how much I like it and then um, I might do a bit of a follow-up. So the next parcel is um, rather convenient actually because I won a competition, um, actually it's not this one, I think it's this one, yes, I won a competition in the week um, from, I think it was Living on, on Twitter, Living Hugi or Living Heige, however you say it, um, and I won one of their Hugi or Heige subscription boxes which they do, which sound awesome, but it's basically like a subscription box that has things that help you live Hugie. So, um, I wanted to kind of make sure that I waited to open this when I had some time alone um, without the noise of the kids um, before I opened it because, you know, it's the kind of thing that you should have time to really kind of enjoy opening that thing. I think that's the whole purpose and point of it. So, you guys can have a look with me because obviously it's the first time that I'm having a look at it as well. So it looks like this, and it's from Living Hugi or Heige. Find them on uh, Twitter. This is really cute, and it smells really good. So it's got a little wooden heart in, which is very cute. And it smells, I don't know what that smell is, but it smells really, really nice. So what else do we have here? Let's have a look. So we've got, oops, I've already dropped the heart. Well done. Uh, so we've got a lovely, lovely card. And looks like a letter or a poem or something. Ah, okay, so it basically says everything that's in it. So I'm not going to say because let's open it together and discover the box together. So let's see. All packaged really, really nicely, and I'm, I'm a sucker for good packaging, so that's always a winner with me. So, what do we have in here? We've got Hoagly rhubarb and vanilla green tea, which sounds very nice. I love rhubarb, never tried it in a tea, so we'll see what that's like. But keen to see that. What else do we have here? Mm, I'm guessing this is what smells really, really nice. The whole box smells like this. So two really nice grey candles, which actually go quite well with my whole theme here. So those will be really, really nice to burn. Maybe when I'm blogging, perhaps. And 
and then we've got a little box of fudge which I love, <laughs> love fudge, hardly ever get to eat it um, but love it and then this is really cute as well look like a little notepad or a little notebook or something very cute I'm sure I will find use for that to make sure Ella doesn't find it because otherwise she will find a use for it for sure and then there's some string and I don't know what I'm smelling it is string but the whole box just smells everything smells of those candles which is really nice or potentially this kind of I think it's potpourri which is really nice maybe it's the potpourri that smells so yeah that's your huge box so I think that's quite cool really nice to win a prize that goes with my book more or less and I guess for anybody that is interested in Hugi, obviously, you know, you might want to consider a living Hugi box, perhaps. This isn't a plug because I want it, obviously, but I think this is quite nice. I mean, imagine a lovely little box of surprises like this turning up each month. Um, so, yeah, and I think they're really reasonably priced. I think they're like £10 a month or something. I'm not sure. You might want to double check that. But definitely check those guys out because that's really nice. Right. On to the next thing, and this is for a review I'm doing, and I'm just looking at it because I'm not sure which way go. I'm not sure which way to open it. So these, I know what these are. These came literally just after I finished filming my first post time video, which is um, so it just missed the first video, but that's okay. So I'm including it here. Um, so basically. Really, really well wrapped. I wasn't expecting a second layer of packaging. But hey, okay. Let's see what we have here. Okay. So, this is for a company that I'm reviewing who are called Myrtle and Maud. And they basically make Mama to Be packs. Now, obviously, I'm not pregnant, but. The reason why I was quite keen in reviewing this, not so much obviously reviewing it, I'm not going to eat it or take it or drink it because I'm not pregnant, they are for pregnant women, um, but it's all to do with helping settling um, like morning sickness, which I suffered from really badly in both my pregnancies. Last time around it felt like much worse than the first time, I think because I had Ella and I couldn't really like have the time to feel sick um so yeah really really tough morning sickness the first and second time round and so I was really really interested in this lovely pack because I just thought wouldn't it be amazing if there was something that actually helped your morning sickness um so I'm going to be reviewing it um in terms of kind of introducing the company and telling you guys what they do and what they're about and then I'll be doing a little giveaway of this pack so definitely keep your eyes up for that because I just think it looks and sounds like a really good product and a really good, like a really nice company and they've got a really nice story as well. So anyway, um, giveaway coming up and also there's a promo code. So there's your promo code, but I'll also put it on the blog as well and um, when I have the review. So that's Merkel and more. So that's everything. As I said, not a massive selection of parcels to open today, but I didn't want to hold on to everything for like another week or so. I wanted to film it while I've got them. And that's the whole point of these post time videos, it's to kind of film them as and when I'm getting stuff. So I'm hoping that you guys enjoyed that. Please let me know what you think, because I have no idea whether you guys even care what I'm getting in my post. Um, so it would be great to know what you think. And if you liked it, please give it a like and don't forget to subscribe.